The oppressor guy's trying to get him, but he can't lock onto me. Oh! Bro, it's so fast against Hydras. Oh, man, these gliding <laughs> functions are too amazing. Double the rewards? Y'all better let me know in the comments below if you want me to make a video about the D-Class Draugr. And here we are at my humble abode. The Starling, definitely saving that for another time. But look at this bad boy. Now, I just gotta modify this. I'm gonna put the armor on, 100% armor. Countermeasures, we'll put the chaff system on. Engine upgrade four, handling race. We'll make the respray a chameleon color though. Ooh, this is looking crispy. We'll make black prismatic and then the secondary we're gonna make it a uh, red prismatic and no not because it's free i swear i'm not that stingy anymore bro these bad boys cost 195,000 smackaroos apparently this turret's equivalent to the stromberg even better than the stromberg miniguns so we're gonna test this out and we're gonna see exactly how powerful it is You can basically shoot 180. Damn, look at this. Okay, let's test out these guns to see how powerful they really are. This one, they're almost like explosive rounds. Oh man, you really gotta keep your aim like on point though. Oh! You see how fast I blew up that truck? That was like four seconds. I really wanna test this against a player and I feel like this is an underrated vehicle. Oh! Uh-oh. Oh! It hasn't blown up or anything. Is he even smoking? Look at this. Blew that up in a couple seconds. Look at that. Y'all seeing this? All right, just for the challenge, we're gonna try having fun. I'm gonna hop the lobby and yeah, we'll see. We'll see what little situations we get ourselves into. Oh, and by the way, I never realized how powerful the ultralight cannons are without y'all telling me in the comments. So if you guys have any ideas or suggestions for new videos, Definitely let me know in the comments below. Am I about to blow up? All right, we're going to try finding a lobby, and we'll go from there. With the muffled carbon prop equipped on this aircraft, you'll be off the radar when gliding or accelerating gently. Oh, this makes it 10 times better. It's basically a stealth mode beast as well. So am I in stealth mode even with the guns out? Because that's a game changer. I think what makes this funnier is that it's a stormy day in Los Santos. Yo, that guy actually been at it, eh? Let's see if he tries killing him again. Okay, I'm going to try creeping down and doing the magic. And I'm gliding, so I'm off radar. Stop this. Okay, this might be hard, though. This is the part where it gets a little difficult. Oh, he is going at him. Bro, he's level 7. Help. Okay, right now I'm gliding. I don't know if you can see me or not up here. Man, what the hell is going on over there? seconds i got a two star water level oh this is amazing as long as i'm gliding i'm actually laughing right now oh oh crap no he died okay i gotta get out of here <laughs> thankfully i'm not smoking or anything nor as long as i don't accelerate no one even knows what i'm up to oh that's him oh motherfucker kick your ass oh no there's an oppressor on me too The oppressor guy's trying to get my ass, but he can't lock onto me. <laughs> I'm gonna try going full speed. All right, today's video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. If you've heard of Raid, you know it's got a ton of champions with over 600 now that you can use in their global PvP or massive PvE boss battles. And it's insane how many variations of bosses are in-game. But today, I want to show you one. Astronix the Dark Fae. She's hella creepy and has the ability to create an evil doppelganger of your whole team. She comes from a special sect of elves that study the power of the night sky. But after she tried to cast a spell to rip the truth from the stars, she sent herself insane and started summoning evil twins and slaughtering people. But she wasn't even 
caught. She went and locked herself up in Doom Tower on her own, which is honestly the creepiest thing of all. This is why my favorite thing in Raid is tackling the unique bosses and discovering their lore within the world. It makes fighting them more interesting and you can learn about their abilities to come up with ways to counter them. This month, Raid's got a non-stop schedule of special events, including Forge Pass Season 3 with some amazing rewards to offer, including a limited edition artifact sec. If that's not enough, Raid's bringing out some new champions as well as some new super cool champion skins for Madame Ceres. But hold on, here's the big one. Later this month, Raid is giving a fan favorite champion the upgrade he deserves. Raid is finally making Death Knight a legendary champion and I can't wait to find out how ultimate Death Knight turns out. So this is the best time to get started in Raid and if you click my link in the description or scan my QR code here on the screen, you'll get bonuses worth $30. That's a free epic champion, Aina, 200,000 silver, 1 energy refill, 1 XP boost and 1 ancient charge so you can summon awesome champions as soon as you get in game. So what are you waiting for? Download Raid today for all these cool benefits and thanks to Raid Shadow Legends for sponsoring this video. No! You got me! Classic oppressor rat. Wait, hold on. It's not dead, is it? Oh yeah, I got destroyed. Oh, I just spawned. Give me some slack. No! Damn, bro, they slumped so freaking fast. Oh, I gotta call MMI for this again, eh? Okay. Okay. Ultralight. At least I don't have to pay for that. Bro, all these cops! Frick off! Ugh. Bro, I gotta wait five minutes to call the ultralight again? Hmm, <laughs> I don't think so, bucko. That's K Plasma. I don't think so, pal. The sad thing is I gotta do this because I gotta wait four minutes. I think it's been four minutes by now. Oh, bro, kick your ass! Please don't. The things I gotta do to be low key. He crashed. I was just hoping that no one would steal my ultralight or blow it up. Because I don't know if it spawned there or not. Okay, now I'm, I can go try getting it. Damn, he freaking crashed and left. Where is that person? <laughs> this love you so sketchy. I don't know if that guy was trying to come after me or not, but hey. I'm out of there. Oh, this guy's trying to get a chat. But he doesn't know I'm right here. I hit my chase. So fast! Bro, that was like two freaking shots! Nah, there's no way. Even he's saying that. <laughs> oh, this is great. And I'm still operator gliding away. This is really hard to do though, or at least for me. I'm scared about this one purple dot. I'm pretty sure he's trying to find me, but I keep going operator. He has no idea where I am. Uh-oh. I just realized I'm out of chafes and there's an oppressor right there. You're right. I'm out of chafes. Oh my god, it's off radar. Oh man, these gliding functions are too amazing. You just gotta glide and you're laughing. Oh, look at that. He's trying to get a jet. You know what? If I glide, I'm pretty sure I can prevent him from me. Okay, you know what? Probably has no idea. I might have to glide the whole way for pure stealth. Oh. Oh! Bro, it's so fast against Hydras. <laughs> This is great. Yo, he's on the beach. Oh, man. You know what? I'm kind of getting fed up with this uh, ultralight. I'm going to do some crazy stuff right now. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh, my gosh. Yo, are you lucky I don't have the chafes? Chafes, 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 whatever. Bro, I got to get the hell off the beach. Jesus. He's back on the beach. Ah! <laughs> I'm running and I'm going to sing on the... Ah! Oh. Vehicle, Starling. I mean, Ultralight. I keep mixing up Starling with Ultralight. Oh my gosh. He's on the freaking oppressor. Yeah, I saw no chance with that. I get him first shot. Oh, oh my god, I actually got him first shot! <laughs> Stop this! Oh, I know he's mad mad right now. I know I would be. <laughs> Bro, he rolled and he died. You know how ass that is? Okay, officer, you got it. You got it. Jeez. 
Jeez Louise. Oh! But why can't I even roll freaking... I swear. Freaking roly-poly, Uli ass. Oh, that was annoying. Is my starlight here? No. Ultralight? Bro, some gremlins trying to snipe me? Oh, what the hell? Ah! <laughs> Yeah, I thought it was someone trying to snipe me from the from the Kasatka side. Damn. Freaking heck, dude. Man, I got no time for this. <laughs> hey, hey, he, he started it. I'm just ending it. Move! Oh my god, these NPCs are so annoying. You better not smash into my car. Look, he's gonna freaking lock on! Uh, I hit the chap, I hit the chap. Uh uh! I don't think so, Bucko. Uh uh! I hit the juke, my boy! He actually got me. <laughs> oh, stop this, my friend. 30 seconds. I gotta wait 30 seconds for the ultralight. I might do some desperate tactic right now. Mm. All right, you know what? Desperate times. How do you see me on ghost? Oh, my. <laughs> Crap, he's right there. I don't think he knows where I am. Oh, he's off radar too. We're both off radar. Yeah, he definitely sees me. Shit balls. Oh, I thought he was going to blow up my beautiful ultralight. Come on. And I'm out of here. Yeah, boy, I'm out of here. I'm scared of the oppressor behind me too. So I got to keep spamming my freaking chives. Is he hiding under the freaking bridge? Oh my gosh, he's hiding under the bridge. Dude, there's this one sketchy oppressor guy. He's coming after me too. Uh oh. 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 No. What if I glide? Can you see me if I glide? <laughs> he doesn't know where I am. <laughs> yes. Like, if I had missiles, this would have been a game changer. Nine. Oh, I'm so screwed. Or am I? Freak, man. Do you know, this is impossible framing him with... Uh-oh. Ah! No! <laughs> it took me like 15 minutes to take on my seatbelt. Ah! Ah! Yes! Oh, buddy. This is not a wild oppressor gremlin. How did I get bad support for that? He literally blew up my freaking ultralight. Fatality. Nice. Okay, this guy's friendly. Okay, if you guys enjoyed that, drop a like, subscribe, and see you guys in the next one. Hey, make sure you guys use ExpressVPN. Three, three months, 50% off. All that good stuff. <laughs>